everybody, so today I wanted to bring you my yearly favorites from 2011 to 2012, and this is going to kind of touch on everything. Um, beauty, skincare, random, just super whatever. So please bear with me, and I hope you guys enjoy. First off, something that I've been loving all year has been the Hourglass Mineral Veil Primer, and I actually used this last year as well. I was introduced to it last year, but this year I have just been using it almost under everything. Um, it's amazing. It's like a pearly consistency. It's just, it's phenomenal. It has SPF, so all year I've been protected in my skin, and all year my makeup has really stayed on. So this has definitely been a yearly favorite. You guys have seen me mention it in almost every video. Well, not every video, but you know what I mean. Um, it's a must. Another yearly favorite has been Dazzle Glasses. You guys know that I am a Dazzle Glass addict. It's like my collection of choice. And my favorite has actually been Moth to Flame. And that's kind of hard to say because I don't have an exact favorite. But this is the one, Moth to Flame. It's the one that I've been grabbing for most. So it's like if I don't know what to wear, it's the one that I'll go for. If I know I need a pink or if I know I need a red or if I know I need a specific color, then that's what I'll grab. But if I don't know what to use, this is just my go-to. It's kind of pink. It's kind of like a rusty color. It is stunning. I just, I adore it. Um, I've also been loving my handy dandy, oopsies, handy dandy fan brush. This seriously saves all of my makeup looks because what happens is the shadow gets on my face and I just dust it off. This is a must. And this is actually from Kirkland. It's a fan brush just from Costco. Any fan brush will do, but this has been an absolute favorite. It has nail glue on there. I got nail glue on it. That's another thing I've been loving is nail polish. And I'm holding up this one just because I don't know which other one to mention. Um, I love OPI nail polish. It's the only nail polish I'll buy other than like $1 stuff because otherwise I'll just go crazy. Um, but I have been loving OPI nail polish and not this exact color. This is just the color that I have on my nails. So that's what I thought I would mention because I've been loving all OPI colors. I've just been painting my nails all year. Um, but this is a Katy Perry Not Like the Movies. And this one's like a greenish color. Greenish like greenish gray but then in the actual light it's like purple so in the sunlight it turns purple it's not going to show up on camera but in real life it's like super super purple so go check this out in the store if you haven't already seen it yeah it's not even showing up in the bottle stupid camera um but i have been loving opi nail polish and just painting my nails in general Something I've been loving are these Aqua Eyes by Makeup Forever, and they are just an absolute must for me. I adore them. I love them. I think they are fabulous. Um, and just any color in general. These are my favorite liners, I think, pretty much, and they have a huge array of color, everything from everything you can imagine. Um, these are the two that I've grabbed for most. That's why I'm featuring them. It's a gold and a black, um, 01 and 010L and 0L. Um, so those are the ones that I've just been loving, but Aqua Eyes are just like my favorite, my go-to. Sometimes I use drugstore, but if I had to choose one and never another liner, this is probably what it would be. Um, another thing have been these bath gels. I like baths, but I love these little bath gels because I haven't been able to find them, but my mom has been finding them probably February of last year. She found them at this little store, so I just keep on going and buying them, and it says, Cassie, these are bath gels. Love, Mom. That's the one that she got me just a week ago or so. Um, but they have, like, little animals and stuff, and what they do, they go inside your bathtub. Oh my god, they are amazing. Like, you're a little froggy. They go in your bathtub and they like explode and they have like this bathy goo in them. It's amazing. Here's a little heart. Um, I think this is a shoe. It's either a, like a really weird seven or it's a shoe. I think it's supposed to be a shoe. Um, but they are like the cutest little things. And I'm so happy that we have a store that has them because these are like my childhood memories. Like, here's a little whale. And then they have a little heart and a little ducky and another little whale and a little star. They're just unbelievable and they bring me back to happy days. So I have been loving these all year long. The thing I've been loving is the Drugstore Neutrogena Oil Free Moisturizer for sensitive skin. Um, this is just my grab and go to. I have other favorite moisturizers that I love for summer or that I love for winter or in between like fall and spring. But this is a year round favorite moisturizer which is why I'm featuring it. Like there are some favorite products that are only favorites for a season and they're not really in here just because they're not. Uh, but this is just a yearly video, so this is a yearly favorite. I really love this stuff. It works for me. Not as moisturizing as I wish it was, but it's better than nothing, and it just works well for my personal skin. Something else I've been loving has been MAC's Color in Honesty, and MAC shadows in general are just always a favorite, but this is like my most used one. As you guys can see, it's like almost gone, and this is in Honesty. And as you guys can see, it is just an absolutely gorgeous, kind of light, shimmery color. It's perfect for dramatic looks. It's perfect for natural looks. Sometimes I'll just sweep this on and just leave. Um, 
Oh, it's kind of fallen. It is absolutely fabulous. So that has been a year's favorite as well. This is Max Paint Pot in Painterly, and as you guys can see, it is just a stunning color. Um, this is like the perfect, perfect color for me. Sometimes I'll use it as a highlight and nothing else. Sometimes, or like, you know, no other highlights. Sometimes I'll actually use it as a base. It is an amazing base for me. There have actually been times where I've mixed it with other things and even been able to do like a powder, or I'm sorry, like a cream blush. It is just fantabulous. So I have been loving this all year long. Paint pots in general are just amazing, um, but definitely this year has been my go-to. Now I guess we'll get into some more random stuff. You guys know that I've always loved bangles for as long as I have known of bangles that existed. Um, but these are just some bangles just to exemplify that. I think these are my December favorites too, but I love bangles. I love them. I love them. Um, I've always loved them. And this kind of symbolizes Indian culture too, like the clothes and the fashion and everything, just because I think it is freaky deaky amazing. This also is kind of a representory of that. You guys know that I have been working on my room for an entire year. Um, I really got serious in it kind of July, so this is kind of like a half a year favorite because this is when I got this buddy. Um, but ever since January is when we've actually been working on re-renovating everything and you know moving up walls and painting and stuff. So technically, my room has been something last year and I'm hoping to get it done, hopefully January or February if I can. Um, but this is just one of those balls that I featured in my other favorites video in July when I really started getting decor in there. This is just like an Indian colored, just I don't even know if it's Indian, it's like a renaissance that has like a little glitter there. This is just something that I've been using to decorate my room and I've just been obsessed with room decor and stuff like that. So this is a favorite. And last but not least, I had a really hard time finding like brown taupey handbags. There's like of course the classic Louis, but other than that, I have a really hard time finding browns and black handbags that I actually like. Well this year, um, this is probably halfway through the year too, I've just been obsessed with this bag and this is really cute. It's like equestrian style. It has like these belted stuff on the sides and it's like a brownish taupey color but it also has like the brown straps. So this is something that I never thought that I would like, but I have just been obsessed with it, and it's big too. Like, it's it's huge. I think this is a beautiful, beautiful bag. It has like gold detail on it and everything. And it's kind of hard for me to find bags like that that I really, really like. So I got it, I've been using it, um, I love it, but especially for like the rest of the year, and especially the fall season, this has just been an absolute go-to. Um, and I know that's really random, but those are my favorites. So let me know what your guys' favorites are for the entire year. Something you've been using all year, something that you've loved all year. Let me know what your absolute favorites are. Um, either post them in the comments or just post a video response. Film your own video and show me what you've been loving. Um, and then if you've tried any of these, be like, oh my god, I love that too. And if you haven't tried any but you want to, be like, for 2012, I'm going to be trying this one. So, oh! Sorry, it scared me. I threw it, but then it scared me because it didn't go up. It went, ugh. I thought it was going to get me. Anyways, I love you guys so much. I hope that you found this video fun and informative. I hope it wasn't too long. I hope I didn't talk too fast. And I will talk to you on the next video. <sighs> Bye. Oh, my kitties have been a favorite. I don't know if that counts though, because I didn't get Mithu until like later in the year. So he's like a little spastic ball of fluff, but he hasn't been until like later in the year. But I've been loving my kitties. I've been loving you guys. You guys have been like a favorite this year, even though I kind of neglected YouTube until July. Um, technically, I didn't even start YouTube until July. Like, I did it last year in 2010, well, two years ago in 2010. Then for 2011, I only did six months of YouTube. So it's only been on YouTube for, like, eight months then. Right? Nine? Anyways, you guys have been a favorite because I'm here every day for you. You guys know that. That is how much I love you and how much you guys mean to me. That's why my fingers are numb, because I reply to your emails and because I love you guys that much. So, yes, that's you guys are always a favorite, um, but I don't even know if I have to mention that because I think you guys already know it. Um, and then again, that was like halfway through the year, so it's kind of like this weird old ball thing and this weird old thing, but that's okay. That's okay. Anyways, I love you guys so much. I hope that you found this video fun and informative and hopefully somewhat educational. Maybe you didn't know that weird glitter balls existed. Um, but I love you guys, and I'll talk to you all tomorrow in the next video. Second kiss of the day. Bye.